Tumbo's on Rodman, Leitner on Longley. Here is Scotty Pippen, free for the first shot, the rebound by Blaylock. Mookie Blaylock with the rebounding nearly seven and a half in the first round, and it's tipped in, and a loose ball picked up with six on the shot clock, and Blaylock fires away, and a wild shot by Mookie. But here's the pass to Pippen, and Blaylock knocked the ball away. Bulls still control, Harper open for three, and the long rebound, high rebound to Blaylock. Center. Michael Jordan with his first shot is short, but Pippen comes back and he misses from the baseline. Jordan out jumps Steve Smith for the loose ball. And it's still loose. And finally, Mookie Blaylock with rebound number four. Yes. Michael Jordan didn't have a good shot, and it's deflected by Blay Mookie Blaylock, who led the NBA in steals this year, picked up one there. Better you're playing with better players. And then the other facet is, can you get high percentage shots? Ron Harper misses at Leitner. A nine-point lead for the Atlanta Hawks. The Bulls have not had the lead in this game. Scotty Pippen finds Harper driving nicely, blocked by Matumbo, and he gets Randy Brown. Also has come in for the Bulls, and he's guarding Bookie Blaylock. Blaylock has out-rebounded the Chicago Bulls 6-5. Did not get a good offensive sequence. Now in the first quarter, Atlanta shot 50%, Chicago 35. Out of bounds, Atlanta ball. Rebounding. So that allows other people that they're not getting banged around and looking for a fatigue problem when you get into that fourth quarter. James committed the foul. No shot for Jordan. He's double teamed. And Williams loses the ball out of bounds. So the Hawks. The field. Yeah, he, he's 0 for 3 and Hawks and he's left them all short. Now the Hawks looking to hold on to the five-point lead, and the Bulls go right in the comeback here. Kukos gets it back, and Blaylock with another rebound. That's nine in the first half for Mookie Blaylock. That's phenomenal. Seven-point lead for Atlanta with three minutes remaining, and a steal. Corbin, they're tipping back defensively, and they're going to call out play uh, in order to win game three. Bulls down by seven. Atlanta led by as much as 11. Pippen, and over the top, turns it over to Parrish might get in the game with his big size. Well, you know, he played two games against Atlanta during the year, averaged six points and six rebounds. And how about that? Shot clock oh, this is the last time a loose ball. And the Hawks have turned it over again. That's been their problem. And Harper with a looping shot. And the tumble. Green and roll. Turnovers and Scotty Pippen's three-point baskets, a big roll in that, and Dennis Rodman looks like a discontinue, and Blaylock slaps it away, and Lichner makes a block. Great defense by both Blaylock and Lichner for the Hawks. Look out long, and Pippen has it knocked away, wide open Harper. Jordan. He's just doing such a magnificent job in reading his defender. When his defender is back on his heels, he's in his face. If he, if he. 87 85. That was a beautiful back cut by Steve Smith. Blaylock, very nearly with his heel. Oh, look out. Happy. He's forcing the defender to wait to go back. Then he jump stops back, shoots it in your face. 31 for Mookie Blaylock. And Blaylock with a steal. 2 on 1. 3 on 1. He's got Smith. Pulls up the three. Attention for rushing shots. And not waiting for the good percentage shot. That stat, 13 fast break points to zero, was major for Chicago. Blaylock with a steal as he blocked Jordan's pass inside. So Mookie Blaylock, who led the league in steals, picking off one there. Don't hand the way things are going. Here is Longley working inside. Loses it to Mookie Blaylock, his second steal. Switch. Watch Leitner and Smith. Smith, they switch and they do not allow Kukoc down the middle. That forces Longley to go one on one turnover. Let's go to Craig Sager. Well, Dick, as you saw, Dennis Rodman left the a pretty good offensive showing Tuesday night. Good pass into Steve Smith, swatted away by Ron Harper. And here come the Bulls again on the open floor. They're dangerous there. Michael Jordan, ooh, ooh way off wow. the glass, but Pippen to it. Way to knock it down, Scotty. He's still on fire. Then at the other end, the ricochet pass from Michael to Pippen. I know he's going to tell Pippen at an yes. time. But a late whistle. All right, late whistle over the back. And the ball is thrown away. The Bulls turning it over as Randy.
And Reagan in the truck leading the way as they have for us all season long. 30 to 28, the Hawks lead, and a foul is pulled. Offensive bliss, and the Bulls keep turning around and getting it out and getting an advantage. I mean, there's no appeals court? No. Not at playoff time. Not while the game is on. Now you play under the rest of playoff time. Harper is left open for three. And it's out of bounds. Last touch by the seven-point lead. The Bulls were up by six. It's been pretty closely contested throughout this first half. Who coach trying to find the range and the rebound. Now you got a shot blocker on your back. You go and you take it with two hands or you come up underneath on the other side. Jordan from the outside and Rodman in the lead. Laylock with 23 and 31 on Tuesday. Jordan slicing it. Harper and a three-second violation called against the Chicago Bulls. Yeah, they catch Rodman down. Leitner. Wanted to burn Rodman on the uh, gamble for the steal. Instead, he missed the three, and Ron Harper blocked out by uh, Blaylock. Now Jordan controls Smith. Jordan posting up. Clear out. Ten on the shot clock. The double comes, but Jordan tipped up by Parrish. No. Foul trouble. There is no reason why Matumbo and Leitner can't go strong. Now keep an eye on this. Michael misses at the top of your screen. You're going to see Robert Parrish come in right here. See, well, here come the Bulls. Down by 14. Harper has it deflected. And I'll tell you, the Atlanta Hawks are crashing. Leitner missed the ball. That was big. Steal by Blaylock. Out of bounds still. Chicago ball. Have to shot. Now you know that they're looking for three-point shooting with their people. The main thing is now you do not want any lobs or quick baskets. Michael Jordan rims the hoop, the rebound by Allen Henderson. And then Dennis Rodman, who has been struggling, is coming back from the uh, knee entry, not on the scoring lineup. Jordan is now walking with the basket. The uh, coaching staff very happy when Rodman was in there because it let Matumbo roll free. Now Matumbo has to watch Longley, more of a scoring threat. Tripping a looting. Blaylock, good ball pressure, and not giving Blaylock very many open looks. Was it deflected? Yes, it was. Last touch by the Hawks. And here's... He's been ejected on two occasions. Jordan. Michael is having the problems causing his team. Has him on the bench with those two personals, but the officials are going to give him that early technical, call the fouls on him, almost as a stun gun to take some of... Happy with the rebound. Pippen. You can see Pippen alter the happy with the rebound. Good coach. Finding Pippen. You can see Pippen alter the shot poorly in the first quarter. Chicago 8 of 23. Atlanta 6 for 16. Michael Jordan is back. And Jordan only two of Initially tried to keep him off the block, but Lenny Wilkins has been consistent. Go at Rodman every chance that they get. Rodman and Matumbo became entangled, and uh, Matumbo went down. He was chant of defense from the crowd. Steve Smith with 10 points all here in the second quarter. Got clocked out of three. Hopper has to fire and hits a casual. 10 gone by third quarter. Now Jordan posting. Jordan able to save it though. Shot clocked out of four. Jordan for three. But Tumbo with the rebound. Just turned the shoulder and the hip right into the defender, Ron Harper. Should have been called for another foul. Allen Henderson has come. The Bulls with a 76-68 lead. Kerr saving that pass, and it's, it's stolen by Corbin. Shot clock at seven. Kerr surprised by that pass. Kukoc has to pop it. Previous games, when those shots fall, everything seems to look better. 
Randy Brown trying to feed Scotty Pippen, but stolen by Mookie Black. Bulls lead 42-25. Jordan double team gets it to Kuka. He thought he was bumped. Not lost two straight at home all season. Hawks so successful here at the Omni, 36 and 5 during the regular season. Third best record in the league. Traveling violation. And a good call. Michael knows it. Just a little look to you. That left foot first. The catch. Yep. A little skip with the left foot and go right. Look at Tumbo staying on Pippen. And his pass broken up. The save by Corbin continues in this third quarter. Later in the third away. Shot clock at five. Hopper for three. And here's Brian Williams in the open floor. Pippen for three. Well, this is the finale of our playoff triple header today. We were preceded by two tightly contested games. A different story uh, here tonight. Parrish tried to save it. Not play at all in the fourth quarter yesterday when it was still a game, and that is unusual. Dennis Rodman is back and goes right to the short. Shot clock at seven. Bottled up, the tumble on the steal. Blaylock chased by Harper. Hey, good question for you to ask Matt, after the game. <laughs> a three-point attack going. As NBA playoffs continue. Back at a playoff record equaled by Mookie Blaylock, Indiana, against Atlanta. Game three, last year's Eastern Conference first round, and Mookie stole a victory from the Pacers. Eight steals in the game. And that tie the record set six other times. In recognition of this classic moment, Miller Beer will donate $1,000 to the Thurgood Marshall Scholarship Fund. They call him the Glove of the East. And his acquisition by Atlanta was a steal. Acquired for Ramil Robinson back in 1992. This is fifth season as a member of the Hawks. To make room for more playing time for Kenny Anderson. And uh, now a three second violation. The in the CBA. Six minutes to go in the fourth quarter. Kerr. Jordan can batter. Chicago able to maintain the commanding lead up by 15. Jordan has a mismatch, wanted the ball against Blaylock. Pippen thought he was fouled by Eldridge for Kastner. Shot clock at five. Hopper for three. Hopper looking to save quarter. Man of defense. Jordan in trouble. Hawks looking for a challenge. The call by Hugh Hollins on Michael Jordan. Well, the Hawks have had fouls to give over the last minute or so, so they can afford to be very aggressive to reach in there, try to get some steals, and if they don't get it, commit the foul. No harm done, but they were able to force the walk there. Imagine what uh, the thoughts are of Phil Jackson and uh, Michael Jordan. Their first shots of the game, and the Bulls playing with a lot of zest and energy in the early going. Michael Jordan, this has come down already for Luke Longley. Longley's been in foul trouble throughout this series. And a Blaylock on the steal. Jordan is back to defend. And Blaylock pulls up Leitner inside to Smith and Leitner his first. Now this is just excellent anticipation by Mookie Blaylock on that high dribble by Jordan. Now watch as he steps back. The defense reacts. Now there's your charge drop off. High school and college, yes, a charge. NBA, no. And also Matumbo, you know that you're rolling, and you hope that you can continue to keep it up. Hawks weather the uh, solid early start by the Bulls. Playlock with a steal, and he won't be challenged this time around. And the Atlanta.
the seventh. There's no reason for the Hawks to play Chicago when they're 28, 29 feet away from the basket. Here's Ron Harper, longly with the offense. Dumbo is fouled, and we'll go to the line. We're going to show you Blaylock right here. Now just watch it. See, right there, he catches the ball. Beautiful steal. Harper thought he had a potential foul. This is Mookie's second steal in the quarter. Now he's off and running. Now he's starting to feel strong about his game. And Jordan gets it out to Pippen. Playlock is back. But Pippen has a height advantage. And we will have a loose ball foul. In the second quarter, Kukoc misses from long range. And Playlock outmaneuvers Dennis Rodman for the rebound. Laylock looking for room and off the glass. Ron Harper squaring up for three. Pippen gets the ball over Clay Big if they're going to make a strong run. 4.35 remaining in the third. Ron Harper moves by 12. And there is Rodman who had the ball knocked away. And it's into the hands now of Mookie Blaylock. Michael Jordan is yet to uh, appear here in the fourth quarter, and they were collision. He starred with the LA Clippers last year and was a late signee this year. Steal by Mookie Blaylock. Read that perfectly. So 